jihad. They stated that they, they wanted to commit jihad. It's a word that often carries negative connotations. Their way is jihad, their method is death. The Merriam-Webster Dictionary defines jihad first as a holy war and second as a personal struggle. Muslim civil rights activists like Nihad Awad, the National Executive Director of the Council on American Islamic Relations, or CARE, say the term is misunderstood. It is a concept, a noble concept within Islam uh, that emphasizes uh, personal struggle within yourself to be a better person, better uh, husband, better wife, you know, better worker, better neighbor. It is not aggression and it does not mean uh, to commit harm against other people. Muslim activists are using a new advertising campaign to try to reclaim a word they say has been abused and distorted by Muslim extremists and by anti-Muslim groups. The ads show Muslims and non-Muslims sharing how they define their personal struggle with slogans like, my jihad is to build bridges through friendship, and my jihad is not to judge people by their cover. The group, which includes Muslim mothers, says the campaign is about making sure Muslim children can grow up in a world where they're judged on their own merits and not according to radical stereotypes. Launched by Ahmed Rahab, a care executive in Chicago, the ads are running in the Windy City, San Francisco, and in Washington, D.C.'s metro system. The goal is to go global and viral. They're encouraging supporters to sponsor ads, to like their page on Facebook, and to use Twitter to share their personal struggle. It's also drawing critics and doubters online with tweets like, Al-Qaeda, hashtag my jihad is carrying earth-shattering, shocking, and terrifying attacks against heart of the land of non-belief, U.S. and Europe. And claiming that critics read the Quran out of context is another way of saying that you wish it did not say what it plainly does, hashtag my jihad. Cares Nawan says changing minds will be an uphill battle, but an important one. My jihad is to protect civil liberties, is to bridge the gap between Muslims and people of other faith. That's my jihad. Athena Jones, CNN, Washington.